All right, I bought some things and I wanna share them with you. They're more like teacher back to school things. I am in my 30s and I'm still posting back to school haul stuff. I have a teacher desk that is not enclosed on all three sides and I like to like hide things underneath it. And so I got this little, ooh, it's a sticky part. It's a table skirt. This is not gonna apply to a lot of people except if you're a teacher, but it's a table skirt and so you just kind of use a sticky adhesive to tape this around the edge of the the desk or table or whatever and then you can hide things underneath it and so i'm very excited about this so again it's not really going to apply to many people other than teachers but glue sticks they had a decent deal on amazon for amazon prime day so i got 30 of little glue sticks because you can never have enough of those I teach third grade and we still go, go through tons of glue sticks. So, and I also got some erasers. Now my class is kind of like bright, brightly colored and it's like happy faces. That's kind of like the theme in my room. And so, uh, these erasers were just too cute to pass up. Now I don't love those little erasers that go on the pencil heads. They just don't really last long and the kids lose them really quickly and they end up on the floor or totally destroyed and like bitten off. So these are good erasers. So if you're going to get your kid some erasers or if you're a teacher out there and you want to get some supplies for your classroom, these ones are really good. Uh, I like with the regular pink ones, I would cut them in half and then just give each student half of one because uh, you really don't need the whole thing. But these are too pretty to, you know, cut up. So I'm going to probably give every student one of these on their desks um, for their supplies on the first day of school. And then this is something that I am super excited for. So this was actually sent to me from Kodak and it looks like this. It's called the Mini 3 Era M300. So what you do is like, this is like a Bluetooth printer. And so in my classroom, I do have a lot of photos of the kids all over the room. And I like to do that because I think it creates like a nice classroom community. Like kids love to see themselves in pictures. And so anytime we have like a fun event or even if it's just a random day, I'll take pictures of them on my phone. I don't post them on social media, but I do print them and then keep them in the classroom. And this makes it so much easier because what I would do is I would take pictures of them and then I would send it off to Walgreens and have like actual photos printed and then I'd have to go pick them up and it was just kind of a pain. But this, you just connect it with your uh, like iPhone or whatever phone you have. There's a little on button at the bottom here. So you just turn that on. Hopefully you can see that like light up and then you download the app on your phone and there's directions for this thing in there and you just connect your phone to this with using Bluetooth and then it allows you to print any of the pictures that you would want right from this little device. So here's where it comes out. So this is what it looks like when it prints out. I'm super impressed with the picture quality. You can choose to have a border around it, which is what I did, or you can just use up the entire space. And it's so quick, it's so easy, it's so convenient. I've been wanting one of these for so long, so I was super thankful that they sent this over to me. Uh, I'll use this constantly. And the kids really appreciate it because they love seeing pictures of themselves. And this is super cool. So if you're a teacher and you're looking to have pictures in your classroom and just make it a little bit easier on you, then highly recommend this little tool. It's so cool. Next thing, you can never have enough Expo markers. We go through these like crazy in third grade. I use them. They have like their own little personal whiteboard. And so each student will have one of these. And then when we're doing like a math lesson or something like that, and I'm trying to check for understanding, they'll write their answer on their whiteboard and kind of show their work so that way I can see like where their where their brain's going see if they've got it or not so these are essential and then when I'm teaching I like to use color expo markers so that way I can kind of like separate things out to make it easier to see and easier to understand so I got a huge pack of the colored expo markers so that is all I got for right now there will be more coming because I still have to go shopping for my daughter for for back to school she is starting TK <laughs> It's hard to believe like some of you guys have been around since I've been like trying to get pregnant or some of you guys have even been around since before I was married, which is crazy. So thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you guys next time. Bye.